Yeah, so the space, we're calling it District 2012, and it's going to be an entrepreneurial innovation and cultural hub here on the southeast side of Grand Rapids, where we're looking to give uh, black businesses that are currently in business and those aspiring to be in business a launch pad to grow their businesses here in the community. My business personally has has had a, um, a, a huge impact as far as they, they walk me through challenges, like when there was obstacles that we faced as a business, I literally would call Grab and they would literally come have a meeting and we would figure out how we was gonna knock down whatever was in our way. So having that type of support is unmatched. You can't get that. Maybe it's other place you could get that, but in Grand Rapids, you can't get that. So you gotta come, you gotta come here and I'm glad that there's going to be a here. So having a, a physical location is gonna be is, is going to be amazing. I live in this area. Um, I service clients in this area. So it's a, an amazing opportunity for black business owners to just have a central hub and a location and a platform to be able to seek services and receive services, but also get advice from other business owners and really create a network um, of opportunity for black business owners. And Jamil has you know, really blessed us with the, with the opportunity to have an impact um, as a black owned startup. You know, one of one of two firms I think in Grand Rapids. Um, it, it takes a special place with us and inside of our work and how we how we really um, quantify impact in architecture. You know, we always say one of the main elements of education is exposure, right? And when you expose future generations to entrepreneurship and business ownership, and hey, this is a place that you could come and learn from people who look like you, who talk like you, who dress like you, who know people who know you. That is a big key in generational growth, right? And so throughout time, that will have an immediate impact on the growth of black business owners in this community, entrepreneurship in this community, and pride within this community. And Grab will hopefully be the center point of all of that.